Hello guys, welcome back to some more Assassin's Creed 3 Remastered. Um, we made it to Brazil last time after we finished Thomas Hickey, got the Animus. Look at another power source, John and Rebecca, you know what I'm saying? And uh, we're in Brazil, man. Where am I supposed to go? No map, nothing, just desert. You copy now? Loud and clear. What's the plan? According to our intel, the power source is being worn as a bracelet by some tycoon's trophy wife. We're working on pinpointing her location, but she's hmm. most likely inside a VIP booth on the stadium's Sir, upper level. I'll update you when I know more. Now to find a ticket. We don't have time to play nice. Steal someone else's. A bit of a dick move, don't you think? <laughs> well, Steal I guess someone else's. Try and sneak past security instead. Sneaking past security, it is. Whoa. That doesn't look like normal security. Are obscure go agents. Cross is probably here too. You need to be careful. Just Don't gonna go through you. here. And there we go. Your target's definitely in the VIP area. The entrance is the best in the concourse. I got stuck. Chame a segurança imediatamente se ouvir. Oh, you can't see me. You can't see me. Don't let them see you. Right. Set up a checkpoint. Oh. Slowly does it. There we go. Wait. This is the bathroom. Uh, Stay close to the crowd and you should be okay. Or look for yo. a way around. Seriously, I'm wanted to deal with stadiums and piss troughs. It's disgusting. In Brazil? I mean, who thought they were a good idea? Troughs are time and cost efficient. I don't even see a stall in here. Yeah, what if good. I have to take a dump? Yeah, please just mute the microphone if you do. Hmm. <laughs> so he doesn't hear that. Looks like I'm close. Shit. Another checkpoint. You're gonna have to find another way around. Security. Is this another way around? Watch your back, your audience. Como assim? Trabalho aqui há 15 anos e nunca vi nada como isso. Quem vocês pensam que são? Sugiro abaixar o tom de voz. Doggy! Não, ele não causa nós. Olha, aconteceu só isso. A gente não queria que acontecesse. Watch him through here. Sente muito. Ela é minha irmã, cara. A porra da minha irmãzinha. Okay, through the window. Making progress. Making past security. Yeah. Almost there, Dustin. She's just on the other side of the stadium. Other side. Other side. Whenever you think it's easy, bro, it's not. I'm gonna walk right past you. That guy's nuts. I kill you, la bala. Oh, it's a fighting course stadium.
go that way, I guess. Okay, we are on the other side now. That guy is having sweet dreams. Everybody is. It's lit down here, bro. Oh, whoa. Yo, yo. Calm down, bro. Oh, it's the guy, uh, Daniel Cross. What's his name? Desmond, Ezio, Altair, Connor, hate them. I got it all, baby. Just to beat the shit out of them. Aliesta! Where's the metro? What's going on? That was so stupid. Okay, Metro it says right here, Metro. That was slick. Other way, other way, other way, other way. Run, Desmond. Like nothing happened. Like an assassin. Just like that. Head him back. We can get back to Connor whenever you're ready, Desmond. Unless you want to plug in the power source first. Up to you. Actually, let's plug this power source. Let's have some conversations. So, what's the latest? Learn anything interesting while you're exploring? They were working on some weird stuff towards the end. Trying to engineer new bodies and store their minds inside computers. Failure after failure. It must have been hard for them. I worry about it too. I mean, they say there's something in here that'll help us. But what is it? Why is it locked up if it's exactly what we need? I don't know. Maybe it's dangerous. Maybe they wanted to make sure only you could reach it. That's the other question. What makes me so special? I guess we'll know once we open the door. I think it's that DNA. Hey. I hope it's not uncomfortable for me to ask, but what happened with Lucy? I don't know. I'm sorry, I shouldn't have said anything. No, it's fine. I really don't know. I was talking to my dad about it. It's, it's hard to say. I mean, Juno definitely took control, but I think I agreed to it on some level. I think I let her in. No. <laughs> That's not right. It, it wasn't her. Not exactly. It, it was more like a, a program. Does that sound weird? It, it showed me things. What'd you see? That if I didn't stop Lucy, Abstergo would get the apple, and we'd all be dead. I still don't understand why she turned on us. I'm sure she thought she was doing the right thing. Wow, so the apple showed. I gotta get back to work. You might want to do the same. I agree. Who else wants to talk? Want to talk, Pops? I can't believe it's taken me so long to ask, but... How's Mom? 
She's not. No, 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 no. Your mother is fine. Oh, we fine. talked about this already. We decided it was safer if we split up. For I can't believe it's taken me so long to ask. Yeah, we talked about this. Unbelievable. What's up? Your politicians are constantly referencing the Founding Fathers and insisting they must have been in support of one thing or another. I have never seen such a blatant disregard for history. That's just typical political propaganda. It's also dishonest and delusional. How can anyone claim to know what these people wanted based off what is it? scraps of paper and wishful thinking? They're looking for intent. What these men envisioned for our country and its future. Idealistic and unlikely. I don't think most of your presidents and senators and judges care what the founders thought. Nope. They just want to know how they can bend old words to achieve modern goals. Yep. Who cares if they were deists or theists or wanted a central bank? Why do people need the validation? What should matter is what you, as an individual, believe and why you believe it. What, are we so insecure that we have to find 18th century letters to validate our beliefs. Oh, look, Mum, a dead man agreed with me. Maybe. If you transpose the letters in his shopping list, you can plainly see he was on my side. Jesus, Sean. That's a cynical way to look at it. Doesn't make it less true. Sean is a psycho. Now, last time this door opened, but we gonna connect that power source. No. Oh. What is a fact? Is it fixed? Immutable? Certain in its existence and only awaiting discovery? Or might it be changed? Here we learn the answer and thought that it might be. They were used to command, to control. Also them. discovered another use. When enough sat and thrall and were told to believe, their thoughts took on form. If a hundred minds could wish away a wall or create a tree, what might a thousand do? Ten thousand more. Might we change? Sounds crazy. We resolved to send one into the sky where it might illuminate us all. Once placed, a sentence would be uttered. Make us safe. In this way, we would change the consensus. We would save the world. But it never came to be. A dozen of them skyward, but there was no way to maintain control, to direct the beam, to enthrall the world, to speak the words. Though this was strange and dangerous, what we tried next was worse. What we tried next, what worse? was worse but what did you try next are you gonna tell me like so they use the apple to control minds and then they use the minds to do stuff which is oops She 
called out across time That's in you. the hopes that you might be saved. She hid messages where none might find them, save for you and those within this place. Fascinating. I'm tired of it. The cryptic warnings, the threats. Just tell us what you want! But they are. We saw the Nephilim there. We seem like grasshoppers in our own eyes, and we look the same to them. Imagine trying to explain all this to a two-year-old, to a grasshopper. When they said the will of the gods was unknowable, they meant it. Literally. Mysterious I ways. Her, I killed Lucy. saw what she was. What would happen if I let her live? I could have stopped myself. I mean, there was a force there. But I didn't have to. I chose to. Desmond, Lucy was going to betray us and take the apple back to Abstergo. I saw the satellite launched. I saw them turn it on, and then... It failed. Whatever's on the other side of that door, it benefits Juno. We need to be careful. Yeah, bro, I told you, bro, that Juno, bro, she's... I wouldn't... I wouldn't trust her. Ooh, she waiting. Stop it, stop it. Um, this way? No. This way? Am I going around in circles? Yes, I am. Okay. stories that's it back to the animus 
I'm telling you, there's something down here. Don't be daft. I don't know. Maybe they were sleeping or something and we woke them. Some kind of cryogenics or cryogenics. hibernation. I mean, how do we know what the hell they were doing down here? They were working on a bunch of different solutions, but nothing worked. Just went from one to the next, and then... I don't know. They must have left at some point. After the end. Hmm. I wonder what the world would be like if they'd succeeded. I'm more concerned about what it'll be like if we don't. Salvation. They found a way. Too late for them, but not for you. Sealed to protect yeah, All these riddles, bro. Now Because we gotta find the key then. Oh, look at that. I found a third power source. Already? It popped up in an earlier search, but I've only just managed to confirm it. Where? There's a museum in Cairo with one on display. I guess Connor will have to wait. No, you stay. We need to find that key, and time is running out. I'll make the trip. What about Cairo, Cross? Egypt? That's where I'm from. Alexandria, Egypt. Gonna be fine. I'll be back soon. Ready when you are, Desmond. Winter approaches. The air is still and sharp with grim expectation. The others sense it too and go about their work with uncommon urgency. I would like to help them, but more pressing matters now demand my attention. The Templars have targeted George Washington directly, and will not rest until he is dead. I had hoped to shield him from this knowledge, but Thomas Hickey ended any hope I had of staying silent. And so I have resolved to share everything I know of the Templars and their plots, of who I really am. Achilles finds fault in this, and we argue every day. But there is simply too much now at stake to maintain restraint. Don't do this, Connor! Then what would you propose we do? Sit and watch while the Templars take control? We are sworn to stop them, or have you forgotten? Assassins are meant to be quiet, precise. We do not go announcing conspiracies from the rooftops to all who pass by. Who are you to lecture anyone? You locked yourself away in this crumbling heap and gave up on the Brotherhood entirely. Since the day I arrived, you've done nothing but discourage me. And on the rare occasions you've chosen to help, you've done so little, you may as well have done nothing at all. How dare you! Then tell me, on you. whose watch did the Brotherhood falter? Whose inaction allowed the Templar Order to grow so large that it now controls an entire nation? If I sought to dissuade you, it was because you knew nothing. If I was reluctant to contribute, it was because you were naive. A thousand times you would have died and taken God knows how many with you. Let me tell you something, Connor. Life is not a fairy tale, and there are no happy endings. No. Not when men like you are left in charge. Wow. It's cool, man. It's harsh. In your haste to save the world, boy, take care you don't destroy it. Ha! Interesting. Okay. Wow, man, like he said, he lived in nothing at all after all this year of training, knowledge, and wisdom. Well,
Oh yeah. Yeah, ma. Yeah, ma. In the cab, bro. Yeah, ma. Um, it looks like we made it. That was a long ride. Who that? Who that? Um, missing supplies. Okay, sorry, Mish. Commander. Connor. Oh, that's George Washington. Any word on Lee? Not yet. My apologies. I've been distracted. Supply caravans meant for the camp have gone missing. I suspect treachery. A traitor named Benjamin Church, recently released from prison, has vanished as well. The two events are surely related. What was his crime? He was caught sending letters to the Loyalists detailing our troop strength. He claimed it was a scare tactic, that we might avoid war. A poor lie. I will find church for you. Why? What reason have you to help? Does it matter? As you wish. We've received reports of trouble along the southern road. Might be he's responsible. I suggest you begin your search there. Hmm. Okay. Return to the abandoned church. Who you? Ah, Connor. What Marque do you think of my work thus far? The men are bolstered, focused. It is good you have come. Uh, you are too kind. Lord knows my journey was far from certain. The trials we suffered getting here were strange and many. <laughs> I dressed as a woman, Connor, to evade British spies. Did you know that? I did not. Embarrassing. As a woman, you say? It is the truth. King George had already stopped our crossing once in Bordeaux, threatening to seize my newly purchased ship, La Victoire, and arrest me. But I was born stubborn, La and such a warning could not dissuade me. So we rode for Spain and bought passage aboard the ship there. George's spies had followed us every step of the way. Disguise was the only remaining option. Mon Dieu. No man can Mon Dieu. Your and you are invaluable to the cause. You did what you needed to do. <laughs> I am certain I would have done the same. <laughs> but of course you would. I expect nothing less. I mean, I try, man. I try. Get my horsey horse. The snow is really thick. Get on the horse. You really need a horse in the snow.
looks like it's over here. This house. The abandoned church. Ooh, papa. Father. Connor. Any last words? Wait. A poor choice. <laughs> <laughs> Come to check up on Church. Make sure he's stolen enough for your British brothers. Benjamin Church is no brother of mine. No more than the Redcoats or their idiot king. Oh, I expected naivete, but this... The Templars do not fight for the crown. We seek the same as you, boy. Freedom, justice, independence. But... Hmm? But what? Johnson, Pitcairn, Hickey. They sought to steal land, to sack towns, to murder George Washington. Johnson sought to own the land, that we might keep it safe. Pitcairn aimed to encourage diplomacy, which you cocked up thoroughly enough to start a goddamn war. And Hickey? George Washington is a wretched leader. He's lost nearly every battle in which he's taken part. The man's racked with uncertainty and insecurity. Only look at Valley Forge to know my words are true. We're all better off without him. Look, much as I'd love to spar with you, I live Benjamin close to Valley Forge is as big as his ego. You clearly want the supplies he's stolen. I want him punished. Our interests are aligned. Mm, I what do you something. propose? A truce. Perhaps. Perhaps some time together might do us good. You are my son, after all, and might still be saved from your ignorance. I can kill you now, if you prefer. You can try. Excellent. Shall we be off? Do you even know where Benjamin Church has gone? I'm afraid not. I'd hoped to ambush him when he or one of his men returned here. It seems I'm too late. They've come and cleared the place out. So we're gonna be working I with our be father able now. To track him. A little father son time. There were rations inside the crates, medical supplies and clothing as well. Tracks? Snow has obscured the tracks, but enough remains that we can still follow. Enough remains that we can still follow. Ooh. Just my look. Going to freeze to death if I don't get this fixed. Uh, for a beating Ben Church's man. Well played. Come here, driver. Let me catch you. Gotcha. Where are you going? It's not wise to run. What do you want? Where is Benjamin Church? I don't know. We was riding for a cup just north of here. It's where we normally unload the cargo. He's gonna shoot him. Don't shoot him, man. No. no. You did not have to kill him. Let's not waste time with all this pointless banter. Go catch up with the rest of Church's men. Infiltrate that camp of theirs and see what you can discover. And what about you? If you mind, just do as I ask. What? You, you trying to be my father now? Everybody's lost, man. Do not get detected while eavesdropping. Oh, 
Are you still talking? Hey, we had it here a little bit. business to be sure or not sure i just do as church asks if you're so concerned take it up with him is he here <laughs> of course not i did in new york the last i heard oh, i didn't even plain profile. sight but on account of him not wanting to go back to jail and all oh rabbit right. i mean hiding in plain sight Look what we found. He was creeping around the camp all suspicious life. No. Must be a Yank spy. Ah, he's something else. Something special. Isn't that right, Haytham? Hmm. Church told me all about you. And you should know better than this. <clears throat> You're not really in a position to be making threats, are you? Not yet. Hmm. <laughs> Not yet. Up. How about this? Yeah. Once he's dealt with these louts, meet me in New York. What? He's gonna leave me? You mean to just leave now? If you can't handle a couple of mercenaries, then we've really no business working together. Unbelievable. He just left us in the middle of a fight to die and we saved him from death. And he just left us like that and he's like dead. Come on. 
dead. I can't believe our dad just left us to death like that. Say, come meet me in New York. Dude. Well, I guess I'm gonna end this episode here, guys. Thank you for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Help me out. And uh, have a nice day, man. Peace.